going on guys? Beastly Gamer here. Welcome back to the channel. Today I want to make a quick video about Konami and what, what they could have done, what they can do. They still can do. They can turn it around. If they uh, if there was someone in a position of authority at the company who could actually see the forest for the trees. Now, Konami's done everything the opposite of what gamers have wanted for the last almost two years. They've fired incredibly talented uh, artists and developers and uh, they've pretty much halted the game franchises that have actually made them household names. Games like uh, Silent Hill, games like Castlevania, games like Metal Gear have all been trampled on by the, uh, the, the elite, the power elite at Konami. Now, we all know they've been going in this direction with the Pachinko Machines, and unfortunately, the Pachinko Machines have actually taken a huge dip. They've been losing money on their Pachinko Machines. They have not been doing well with them in Japan. Uh, and the the one thing that's actually making Konami money right now, believe it or not, is its video game business. Games like Metal Gear Solid. Uh, you guys might not know this, but Metal Gear Solid just hit 49.2 million sold. So that includes the entire uh, franchise, all the, the series of games. 49.2 million sold. That's 50 million uh, copies of games that have been sold on, on under Konami's thumb. That's a lot of money. It's something to really be proud of. They've actually turned a profit as a company because of their video game sales. Now, they have taken a, a, a little hit. They've actually slowed down as far as their profit. But they did see a, a nice jump in profits due to their video game business and namely the Metal Gear Solid franchise. They also are, are making a little bit of money on their mobile efforts. But their electronic segment of Konami is actually the one that's making them the biggest amount of money. They're also making money in their fitness uh, category as well which is weird konami fitness uh but their pachinko machines are actually down so what is konami to do in a situation like this i mean are they going to continue to just focus on pachinko and and, and health machines or are they going to swallow their pride and, and take that l and turn around do what's right for the people who, who built the company you know the lifeblood of the company are, are your consumers we're the ones out here spending money on these games we're the ones who've been supporting you for the last 30 years you know i bought contra you know i bought all these old games i bought the ninja turtle games i bought you know i bought all the castlevania games i bought these games i and i got metal gear solid 5 i got metal gear 4 you know i got the stupid one with the the ninja i got all these metal gear games i've, I've supported the company you guys have too konami could actually be they could be a household name again they could not be uh seen in the light that they are right now but the thing is they've got to come out to the public they got to say hey look guys We've done some things that may appear to be very, very bad in the eyes of our consumers. And while you don't have all the facts, and no one does, but you know, but the people here and the people who are intimately involved in said situations, we want to come out and let you guys know that we're still here for you. You know, here is the next Silent Hill game. Boom. Here is the next Metal Gear game. Boom. Here is the next, God forbid, Castlevania or something. Or here is, you know, a legacy classics collection of these games and and we apologize for not coming out sooner and letting you guys know how we feel uh, and letting you guys know that we think that you are important to us we know that you guys are important to us uh, we don't want to leave the lifeblood of our company behind to pursue uh, workout machines and pachinko machines and that's not what Konami has been doing that's not how they made all their money I know they've made tons of money doing those kind of things but they're not a household name because of those things people talk about konami because of the video games that they've made they've made some great great video games throughout the history of video gaming they've made some incredible games and uh it, it's one of those situations you know i see a story it says metal gear solid franchises top 49 million as konami uh, reports profits it's good that they're reporting profits but i don't want them to profit at all until they come out and treat the consumer with a little bit of dignity and respect the respect that you deserve the, the respect that I deserve. You know, we're, we're the people who funded this company and made it into a multi-billion dollar company. And uh, it's it's one of those situations where they see the pachinko machines losing money. They see their other avenues of income failing or, or struggling, but their video games are still selling. And, and the fact that there's still millions and millions and millions of people out there who would still support the company if they came out, did an about face and apologized for the way that they treated us, uh, says a lot about the company right now that they know that and they still don't give a damn they know that and they still won't come out and say hey look our bad 
whatever happened between us and, Ko and Kojima was really fucked up. Uh, and we don't want you guys to, to, to suffer for it. Uh, and we apologize for being quiet about it this long. We apologize for not talking to you guys about it and shutting you out because you guys have been with us for many, many years. It's unfortunate. It's a good good feel for them, at least. They got 49.2 million copies of Metal Gear Solid games sold. They're reporting uh, their revenue for the quarter was $481.5 million. That's down 3.5% from what they generated last year. Uh, and their operating profit, though, was $88.7 million. That's up 40% from last year. So they're, they're making a lot of money on the back of these games. They need to think about that. You guys let me know what you think in the comments. Metal Gear Solid, 49.2 million copies sold. And Konami still quiet as a baby's fart. Will not speak to the consumers and let us know what their plans are for us, the gamers. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, give a thumbs up. Show support for the channel. Follow me on Facebook. Follow me on Twitter. Tell all your friends about me. Tell your mother about me. She doesn't know. Just, just tell her. I'm the Beastly Gamer, and I'll see you guys next time. Take off.